Welcome to Automotive Territory. Just because Tesla has not yet released an off-road capable electric truck, it does not mean that all-terrain EVs are non-existent. On the contrary, this vacuum on the market nudges other manufacturers to step in and take on the off-roading challenges of today. In this episode, we wanted to show you a list of the most impressive electric cars and buggies that do not pass on the chance to get dirty and are ready to tackle any terrains. But wait a second. Before we show you the video, consider subscribing to our channel. We guarantee informative automotive content at least twice a week. Enjoy the ride! Nikola NZT Nikola Motor Company has recently unveiled the production-ready model of their four-wheel drive electric all-terrain vehicle NZT that was built on the basis of the previously developed Nikola Zero. The manufacturer gave a new name to the buggy, reworked the design, decreased the price, and moved forward the delivery dates. The model lineup of Nikola NZT will consist of four modifications, with the numerical designations corresponding to the max power output in kilowatts, that translate to up to 590 horsepower with the torque reaching 722 pound-feet. The price of the humblest model is now $29,000, while the most powerful NZT440 will cost 55 grand. With the Nikola UTV, you get direct four-wheel drive without belts, spacious interior, Fox 3.0 internal bypass shocks, and all of the benefits of an electric vehicle, like instant torque with 3.5 to 5.3 seconds 0 to 6 acceleration, zero emissions, dust and waterproofing, and the range of at least 90 miles or up to 150 miles per charge. The company has already started collecting pre-orders, and the production is scheduled to start late 2018 so you might be able to get your Nikola UTV within a year. B1 from Bollinger Motors From the first look, this car could be confused with the World War II military truck, but under its unorthodox body, you'll find a real high-tech Tesla-like setup. B1 carries a 4x4 all-electric powertrain designed for both on- and off-road conditions. It comes in two modifications, a pickup or an SUV, Plus, a very clever design choice was made to increase practicality. Due to the absence of an engine, it can carry long pieces of lumber right in the middle. The battery capacity ensures 200 miles of range, and a unique pneumatic suspension raises it up to 20 inches off the ground. Pre-orders for Bollinger have already started, with the first units being delivered early 2019. Xing Mobility Miss R the Taiwan-based startup Xing Mobility was founded in 2015 as a developer of electric powertrain systems. Their strategy of bringing innovation to the table is based on the development of high-performance automobiles and then mirroring the progress on the commercial, industrial and public vehicles for everyday use. Among the recent projects, we should point out the first in the world rally-inspired supercar Miss R that is both track and off-road capable. The compact beast is powered by a state-of-the-art immersion cooling modular battery system with maximum output of 1 MW or 1,341 horsepower. Four independent electric motors ensure all-wheel drive capability and superior control. It is still unknown when, if ever, the production automobiles from Xing Mobility will be mass-produced, but we are nevertheless excited about this powerful newcomer. Chrysler G Wagon Externally, the electric G-Class from Chrysler differs only in detail, and on the inside, you'll be getting the same level of luxury and comfort. The only difference is that the dashboard was elegantly adapted for the electric drive. Due to the compact design of the Chrysler batteries, it was possible to install two battery packs with a total capacity of 80 kWh that ensured unmatched range. This G-Class gets two electric motors, with combined 360 kilowatt or 483 horsepower. And of course, the all-wheel drive capability for ultimate off-roading is also present. Though somewhat irrelevant, 0 to 6 acceleration takes just 5.6 seconds, top speed is at 115 miles per hour, and 2.6 tons or 5,600 pounds curb weight is no complication. By the way, Arlen Schwarzenegger is a known promoter of electric transport and clean energy. So notably, the first ever Chrysler G-Class was built from his personal gallant wagon as a promotion. 
Porsche Mission E Cross Turismo. The first all electric Porsche car to go on sale in 2019 will be the Porsche Taycan Sport Sedan. However, this manufacturer has already presented the next step of their electrification strategy, which is a youth oriented Mission E Cross Turismo CUV. The car is oriented for utility with increased ground clearance and foldable backrests for extra boot space. However, it remains a marvel of high tech. The display technology has eye tracking control, lighting as matrix LED, and seats are futuristically sporty. The total powertrain output goes over 600 horses or 440 kilowatt, which results in 3.5 seconds 0 to 60 time. And according to Porsche, multiple accelerations in succession are possible without the loss in performance. Offering the range of 250 miles, 800 volt architecture with 15 minute charge time, this cross utility vehicle might just be the right cocktail of performance. Polaris Ranger when the Polaris Ranger first came out in 2016, it was the first ever UTV to be powered by a lithium-ion battery. The upgrade meant a 500 pounds decrease in weight and doubling of range, which now equals to 50 miles on a charge. The Ranger is a two-seater that is brought into motion by a single 48-volt AC induction electric motor with peak output of 30 horsepower. In a standard driving mode, this UTV is driven by the rear wheels but a true all-wheel drive is available on demand. With a payload capacity of 1,000 pounds, towing capacity of 1,500 pounds and lots of kit accessories available from the manufacturer, this capable off-roader should be able to satisfy the demands of any outdoor junkie. Chrysler Hummer Chrysler Electric is the Austrian company that specializes in e-mobility, battery technology and electric powertrains. They're most known for operating one of the industry's largest car conversion workshops that transforms autos with internal combustion engines into EVs. Among their most impressive projects is the one and only Hummer H1. This mighty beast, which in the ICE version can barely cover 10 miles per gallon, has now become completely emission-free. Its powertrain consists of two electric motors, one on each axle, with a combined output of 485 horses. The truck is equipped with a 100 kWh battery that ensures a max range of 186 miles. Despite a substantial weight of 7,250 pounds, it demonstrates unexpected agility, accelerating from 0 to 60 in 5.6 seconds and developing 75 miles per hour top speed. This vehicle is the only electric off-road Hummer released so far, and unfortunately, the manufacturer is not planning to start mass production of the prototype. Jeep Wrangler Electric Even before Jeep thought about using electric powertrains in its trucks, CAD4X lab from Korean Advanced Institute of Science and Technology converted one of the older JK models into the first fully electric all-terrain Jeep Wrangler. The vehicle is equipped with two 80-horsepower electric motors, delivering 210 pound-feet of torque and 67 miles per hour top speed. Draining power from Olympia Ion battery pack it can last up to 150 miles on a freeway or about 40 miles of off-roading. In addition, the truck is rather successful in rock crawling and overcoming obstacles such as loose soil, barriers and muddy terrain. For example, in 2017, the Korean team managed to tackle Rubicon Trail with it. Axiona EV Axiona is a Spanish energy company that specializes in infrastructure development and renewable energy. As a little side project, most likely for advertising purposes, they developed a 100% eco-powered vehicle that is ready to challenge any terrain. Their electric racer received a 340 horsepower synchronous electric motor capable of delivering 516 pound-feet of torque to all four wheels. The power is drained from six fast charging batteries that have 150 kilowatt hour combined capacity and are connected to photovoltaic solar panels on the roof. With the fast 60-minute charging, Exiona's team managed to become the first ever electric car to finish the famous Dakar race, and they managed to do it in 111 hours. Nissan Leaf ATEV The hatchback ATEV is based on the standard Leaf 1.0 and the Ascenta modification, equipped with a 30 kilowatt hour battery, good for 155 miles of range. 
the remodeling was done by the British engineering company RML Group. They installed new rims, a Speedline SL2 Marmara with Max Sport RB3 tires, good for dirt and sand. Moreover, the updated EV received 6mm aluminum protection for the motor, braking system and suspension. Among the handy add-ons, we also have to point out a large LED lamp for the late night off-roading. As for the interior, it lost some weight by ditching the rear seat, while the rest remained unchanged. As a reminder, the standard Leaf is equipped with a 109 horsepower electric motor that drives front wheels. The most significant achievement of this green ATV was finishing of the 8000 mile Mongol Rally in under two months, crossing 14 countries without major problems. Torque EVL Speed, agility and stable performance are the main characteristics of Torx off-road suppressor EVL. It is a two-seats four-wheel vehicle that is claimed to be perfect for dirt and forest riding and discovering new trails. Electric powertrain makes the ATV quiet, almost maintenance-free and eco-friendly. Lightweight design increases Torx maneuverability and acceleration and super low center of gravity adds stability to the wheelbase. The vehicle is equipped with independent front and rear suspension and disc brakes. It is advertised as a perfect machine for hunting or fishing due to the low motor noise. However, with a 3 to 3.5 hour driving range and a 25 miles per hour top speed, it can be also used for picnicking, trail riding, camping, farming and ultimately conquering any terrain. Yes, the prices for electric off-roaders are much higher, but bear in mind that you're getting a car that requires no gasoline, is very low maintenance and can access any nature preserves that prohibit IC vehicles from driving around. Share with us which is your favorite electric off-road car from the list. May the torque be with you!